good morning students we have been learning about the role of the lok sabha last class i explained a few points remaining points i will explain today role of the lok sabha Lok Sabha is the lower house of the parliament and its first sitting was held on 30 May 1952 just remember that not the point and come to the point all of the Lok Sabha India is a large country of 28 states and 9 union territories which are divided into approximately 545 constituencies depending on the population each state has a fixed number of constituencies in the lok sabha the maximum strength of the lok sabha can be 552 members of which 530 members can be directly elected by the people not more than 20 members from the union territories and two members from from the anglo indian community are chosen by the president of india and the presiding officer the chairman of the lok sabha is the speaker as you know that and who conducts the proceedings and maintains order in the house a deputy speaker carries out functions of the speaker in his absence to point qualifications to become a member of the parliament to the qualifications first one a member uh, has to be a citizen of india should be mentally sound should not be bankrupt must not be holding an office of profit should not have a criminal record should be at least 25 years old minimum must to disclose information on assets and liabilities of self spouse as means wife and depend dependent children while filing the nomination of from for elections so the qualifications to become a member of lok sabha and Next one is elections. Elections. People choose their representatives through elections and voting is done by secret ballot. The ele- elected candidates are called the members of parliament or MPs. the candidate with the highest member of votes represent that constituency in the lok sabha the party which secures the majority means more than half of the seats become the ruling party the parties which are defeated in the elections form the opposition and they keep a check on the policies of ruling party so the tenure tenure means term of the lok sabha is for 5 years the president can be dissolved the lok sabha if the ruling party loses its majority or if the government falls dissolve means a dismiss tenure means a total period of term 5 years current number of members 545 
maximum number of members 552 550 plus 2 appointed okay that's about log of roll of log of thank you